welcome to my review of the pilot episode of Constantine. Constantine is a new TV series on NBC based off of the DC character and Vertigo character, John Constantine. This pilot episode, as far as I saw, if you are a fan of the Hellblazer comics, you will not be disappointed with this TV series because it's more accurate to that. He is an Englishman from Liverpool. He has the habit of smoking. He wears the trench coat that he always wears. He is definitely from the pages of the comics, this character, more so than what we saw in the movie with Keanu Reeves. Now, going into this TV series, I wasn't exactly sure what I was getting myself into because I was never a big fan of John Constantine. But I have to say, after watching the pilot, I've really enjoyed it. I was very surprised by what I saw because I liked it a lot more than I was expecting to like it. And it seems to be the consistent, you know, thing with these DC comic TV series that are coming out, you know, as of recently. I'm going into them not expecting much and coming out of them like, oh my god, that was actually really good. And this TV series is no less than that. It was actually a pretty damn decent pilot episode and there were certain things that I saw from this pilot episode that made me go, Hmm, I'm curious to see where they go with that if they reference back to a certain helmet from a character who I would love to see in a featured film someday. So there were things like that in the pilot episode that really teased something that, of course, if you're aware of the DC universe, you're going to see particular things and you're going to be like, hey, that's there. And again, these TV series throw Easter eggs all over that because they know people who are a fan of the comics or they're a fan of just comics in general, they like that kind of stuff. And this is another example of a TV series or at least a pilot episode that does that pretty damn good in a very subtle way but in a way that makes you want to continue watching to see if that certain thing ever appears in the future. There was a lot of jump scares in this episode that really got me personally so if you're not into that kind of stuff this TV series is not for you but if you love like horror or you like supernatural things you're gonna love this TV series because even from the pilot episode there are certain things in there that are really creepy and just scary and just downright disgusting and if you like that you are going to definitely enjoy this TV series. So overall I really enjoyed it a lot more than I was expecting to. I thought that Matt Ryan did a wonderful job as John Constantine from what I'm aware of him being like in the comics. He looked like the character, he acted like the character, he actually spoke like how I would assume how the character would speak like. Those are certain things that are very important in representing this character on television and I thought he did a wonderful job with it. So that is my review of the pilot episode of Constantine. Thank you for watching and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Fury is directed by David Ayer. It stars Brad Pitt, Logan Lerman, Shia LaBeouf, Michael Pena, and a bunch of very talented actors and actresses. Now the premise of this movie follows the story of five military men. They are in a tank and they go around Germany and they kill Nazis and that's the thing that they do. And the story starts off that it's April 1945 and those who are history buffs know they're at the tail end of World War II. They're just following their orders to go 